monastery, you might ask. We were uh, riding in Bulgaria today. I think we have a video of us being really hot and uncomfortable this afternoon. We stopped for lunch, and then we went to the Internet Cafe, which was air-conditioned. Good Lord, was that a blessing. And then we got on the road again, and we rode for about uh, 20 minutes before we started to see some really big rain clouds. So we pulled over and put on our rain gear and kept riding. And we rode for, mm, I don't know, maybe 15 more minutes before we hit a traffic jam, which turned out to be a truck off the side of the road. That was pretty interesting. How the hell did it get there? I don't know. And the lightning started to be really, really crazy. And we pulled off into a coffee break, a little truck stop. And uh, we got on the highway and pulled off at the first gas station. Wait, wait, wait. And then we decided to uh, continue on to the first exit, which turned out to be a little university town that had lost its power. And then we found a restaurant because we had run into a guy who spoke really good English who said he had friends in a restaurant that were uh, just hanging out drinking some beers and we might be able to uh, find a place through them because they were arranging a place for him. That didn't actually turn out for us, but we did, through the process, meet some people that were building a golf course. We mentioned that there was <laughs> a monastery that we might be able to bunk at, and we are now uh, we are now in the bunkhouse with uh, very wet wood that took a very long time to start, but is now burning quite nicely and pretty hot, actually. And, uh, yeah, here we are. great hanging out with Yosha for the past couple of days, but now he wants to head off. His journey is ending. He wants to go visit his parents, um, the Black Sea. So now we're just buying some vegetables for our last barbecue together. So we're here in Sofia in this really nice city center area with that pleasant casino which is way too expensive for us. They have rooms but not a budget. What do you think of the city? Well, I don't know, like I saw this cathedral which is not really impressive if you saw some German cathedrals actually. <laughs> Ooh. What you Ed, what do you think of Sofia? Oh, beautiful old uh, 16th century uh, sophisticated city of, um, of, uh, of approximately uh, 100,000 goofy tourists. Right? <laughs> That's right, I think we've seen more tourists than we've seen actual Sophians. Basically just a city, right? And I don't really like cities, so I'd say let's get out of here. I agree. Let's blow this town! I hope the weather will be still okay because it has been raining for the last two days and a lot of thunderstorms and stuff. But we want to see a monastery, so, well, let's see. in this ex-communist or communist whatever hotel. <laughs> Let's see. Fantastic roads, fantastic mountains, and I think we just 
nice weather. It's not quite raining now, but it's a little bit misty type thing. Um, this is, what, day 10? Day 11. Ten. The trip. Day 10 of the trip. It's our fifth country and our first tour stop. <laughs> We've had some complaints from Oma saying that there's nothing but bikes and too much bike stories, too many bike pictures, not enough touristy spots, not enough cathedrals, not enough castles. So we gave in. This one's for Oma. Enjoy the monastery. I need one. Oh no, that's a movie. Well, here we go. Here's a movie. So say, ho say hello. So we're here in the middle of nowhere in the mountains. And as you can see, we journalized everything. We have here a little nice campfire set up. And we're going to have great food. We have Bulgarian wine with it. And yeah, here we are. There's no wireless connection though. We okay. still need to work on that one. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, we're good. <laughs> what I was thinking about is a having a Junaizer collection. We're here at a, in a little town in the Carpathians. We, we slowed down a lot on our travels. We just did 150 kilometers today. We're finally into the traveling. We're not rushing anymore. It's really nice to keep that pace and we're having a nice barbecue every night. The weather's getting better, the rain is gone, and it's not so hot, so that's really nice. Um, today will be probably our last night with um, Ed. He will head tomorrow to Macedonia and will continue east towards Turkey then.